Hello everyone, welcome back again to my name and today is the first of two videos where I will review this Christmas bear calendar. It's not only Christmas bear, but it's different bears of all kinds of sorts. And this one will be the bears that could make it to the top 10. So, first off, this one. This one is a pretty dark one, it's a porter, and personally, the bottom two ones as you see right here, I couldn't drink them. <laughs> they were too much heavy for me and I just couldn't. They are probably better for some other people, but for me, I couldn't drink them and that's why they are in the bottom two. This one is a Christmas bear, I think. It is a Yule book, so it's probably a very dark Christmas bear. Also, the number three one, as you can see on all the bottom three ones, they're all black ants, which refer to being a very dark bear so a lot of taste and yeah they're very sweet so this one is also a christmas bear it says christmas bear ale they are not my kind of taste then we're going over to another christmas bear then we have a bay and we have another christmas bear i would say that around here it's like not so drinkable for me and now it starts to get more drinkable for me and this one I think it was actually an okay Christmas bear. It says Yule Hilton, which is like a Christmas greeting. And I think it was, it's okay. It's a Saint Nicholas, also a Christmas bear. You'll see like a theme here, where you can see all the Christmas bear and the dark ones. I can see more light ones on this side. But you will see some odd ones when they come higher as well. Because there are some dark ones that actually prove me wrong. And that's something I really enjoy with this tasting. But we also have this one. I think this was pretty okay. It's a Christmas bear from this Nason. I think it was pretty okay. And I like the design with a little mini Santa little figure. And one bear that I actually had high expectations of that couldn't make it too much for me was this one. First off, it came in a glass, and it was the only one that came in a glass. And it also tasted a little bit of raspberry. I had high expectations, but it tastes really boring to me. It didn't taste enough of the sourness. Also this one, it is just a normal Pilsner. For me, it wasn't any more special than normal commercial Pilsners. I'm sorry for this one, because it is not a normal commercial Pilsner, but that's what it tasted for me. Not too much special. And I love Ipas, but this one was not not anything special, just a little bit sour and didn't taste too much. But I said I love Ipa, but some of them actually impressed me quite a lot because this one is a Christmas bear, but it's not, what can you say, as dark as the other ones. And I think that's a really good thing for me when you have like a little bit light to Christmas bear that you don't have too sweet, but you still have like the seasoning of the Christmas. I think that's like a good way to go for Christmas bear, at least for my taste. Let's try this one. One of the most interesting bears in this calendar. Uh, again, not so much for me, but if you want to taste a really interesting bear from Norway, you can try this one, Snow Blonde, because it tastes a little bit like, like mead. So it is sweet, but not like in a sweet bear way, that it will get really dark, really heavy. It's more of a sweet, like honey way. So it's actually very interesting. And the one, that couldn't make it to top 10 is this one. Again, I love the design of all of this. Even the ones that like is in the far bottom, I love the designs. And this one, it says Yulenek. It's a lot of Christmas decoration all over the can and it tasted all right. It was not my favorite, but I think this actually was good. So I think some of this was pretty all right. Some of this was horrible for me, but again, as I said many times throughout this tasting, it's all about experience. The experience of trying new bears. And I think this has been a very cool ride. And I look very much forward to show you the top 10 because there's some very interesting and someone that tastes really, really good. So thank you so much for watching this video. I'll see you guys in another video tomorrow. Bye!